Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to a Monday, May 30th of 2022. Today is Memorial Day, honoring all those young, brave men and women that uh, paid the ultimate price to keep us free out here. So, uh, yeah, thank you all, you brave, brave souls. We sitting here with Sasha at the moment because she thought I was going to do something with the lawn, which I'm about to do on the lawn, but we're doing other things. So we're rearranging air conditioner stuff. We had an old wall unit that the um, uh, fan motor is making so much noise. So we removed that and um, put one of those uh, high efficiency things that we've been using the last year or two, whatever. So got that in its place. The window that that air, that air conditioner has been in that thing, I don't know, 10, 12 years. And uh, <laughs> there was a lot of, it was messy behind that air conditioner. So it took a lot of cleaning up. And then Kelly went out there because we're afraid the girls are all going to freak out about going back into the pen thinking we're leaving again tomorrow. So Kelly goes, well, I'm going to go clean their pen out really good. Because they were stuck in there. They, you know unfortunately had no choice but to to go in there for for a bit so anyway I'll, I'll give you a quick look at that right quick she needs a little weed eating in there the dogs seem to like that in there but yeah she's got chips all in that little house that was leo's house and um when he was getting older and he was getting getting sick he couldn't he wasn't as mobile he always jumped in the box he liked staying inside there he loved doing these sneak attack things. It was funny. But anyway, he couldn't get in there or he'd get in, he couldn't get out. And he's, I mean, he was a big old, he was half shepherd, half Siberian Husky. So I cut that hole in it. It was some kind of crate we got at work. And uh, anyway, I cut that hole in there so we could go in and out. The girls will not go in that thing for some reason. So Kelly cleaned it. I just got full of junk over time so kelly cleaned it out real good and she had another bale of that chip stuff man it's got cedar in it it smells so good but anyway that's what kelly was doing for quite a while i don't know what what we got weather wise here temperature's not bad it's in the 60s man that cedar really smells good i think it's in the 60s out here but I do need to get the, the jungle lawn fixed here or I'll be trying to do this after work. But good Lord, it's like five o'clock or something out here already. It's funny how quick the day can go when you get little projects going. Anyway, I'll drag that old lawnmower out here. Well, I just now got her done. It's working on eight o'clock at night. Old John Deere, she don't mind that it's wet out here. Just makes a mess out of everything. But, had to get done. Like I say, I don't want to get stuck having to do it after work. What you think, Mama? There is some pretty skies out there starting to accumulate. It is definitely not warm. What's the deal? Yeah, it's cold out here. I just got my t-shirt on, mowing the lawn, and about freezing my butt off. The old barn out there always looking good. Holy moly. Back to the old grind tomorrow. What a bummer. That was a very, very, very nice week. And even got an extra day at the end, with Memorial Day being today. That was pretty cool. All right, let me get all my stuff put away here. I don't think it ever did rain today. I think it rained a little bit this morning. But, uh, man, it's just so cold. And, and, I mean, the roads and stuff dried out. Lawn dried out enough I can mow it. But, uh, yeah, just too many things going on. I had some chores in the house we were doing. Like I was saying earlier, dug that old air conditioner out. I have to figure out how to dispose of that. I don't think you can just throw things like that in the dumpster. It just gets you in trouble because of Freon and stuff like that in it. 
Oddly enough, the thing worked. It's just the um, fan motor, the bearings in it went bad. And it was just so loud you couldn't. I mean, it was, was kind of loud outside, really loud inside the house. <laughs> so we just quit using it. So it was sitting in a spot where one of the other air conditioners could go. So, could go, so we do that. Did that today. <laughs> Speak. I didn't realize that I never put the bistro table kid out here from uh last saturday when i mowed the lawn i go oh i gotta get i gotta take care of that when i get to this part of the lawn and uh yeah it ain't there is that thing flickering it looks like it's flickering this is my iphone 12 mini i've been using all day today i hear leo going crazy about something i haven't checked the tires on this old war wagon in a while i should probably do that right quick huh i've used that new uh-oh. Sasha got in trouble for pulling too hard. Let me go help Mama. Sasha, did you get in trouble? They were so excited to get back out here, they almost knocked Mama over. <laughs> she goes, we don't know that. She goes, we're just wild and was ready to come out from hiding from the lawnmower. So when I do the front lawn, Sasha goes over there and just buries herself underneath that apple tree. And the ground kind of rolls over. And when you're sitting on the lawnmower, you're like, where's she at? And you just see the little red cable going out there. She's, she's hiding. You listening to me? You are listening to me, aren't you? She goes, I hear you. I'm listening forward and backwards all at the same time. Goof. Man. Is this ending off beautiful? I should have tried to sneak in a ride or something. There. That gum slugs going all over the place. So let's check out the old tires. I've used this on my uh, GT650. Man, does that thing go fast. But I, I'm going to grab a tire gauge just to make sure they're, they're perfect when I'm done. Old war wagon. Wow. Look at the colors in that. And it's about to get really pretty once that sun starts setting. Mm, mm, mm. Nice. So last time I was showing you this this thing, I didn't, the, the units, you just push and hold. Kilopascals, bars, PSI. I think the cord is about the same length as it was on the um, on the smaller one. This thing needs tires. I keep saying that. We're gonna be stuck riding it, driving the um, Acura because I keep procrastinating. I think 28 is what what the car calls for. But um, I've been putting it at, at 32. I mean, most cars nowadays are around 35. So I've been sitting at 32. But listen to how, how this thing runs. <laughs> So you can't, oh, I must have, oh, it bleeds off. It was exactly 32. That thing only holds air for a while, but I, I can't have my hands in three places at once, but it was exactly 32. I love it. That other one, you know, it was great for motorcycle tires, but lawn tractors, and you weren't supposed to use it on car tires at all. But, um, I mean, I did use it, but the thing had a timeout feature. I think the motor, it was kind of overheat protection kind of a thing. So it would run for a bit and it shut off. And then when it balanced out, it was several lows. He had to, you know, hit pump again. It's just this endless cycle. I just got the little four amp um, M18 battery in there now. Pardon me. That's the smallest one they got. 
But man, with the speed, you gotta love that. I love it. When they don't mess around, they just get things done. Man, that has really turned out to be fantastic out here today. <laughs> two for two. Spot on. You know, I love these things. I love how fast it is, too. The other one, you know, even one of the things I think caused it to time out is it was slow. But like I say, it's great for motorcycle tires, you know, when they're just a couple of pounds, a few pounds low. I wish you had a quick release end, end on them. But they must calculate for it because it's a little bit when you unscrew it. It always seems to work out. They must um, assume there's going to be some loss. But <laughs> but both of these are 27. And uh, so they're, the time or temperature or whatever is, is being consistent in, a, in its pressure loss, which is always nice to see. You've got one that's really, look how dirty that thing is. There's like no... Uh, shine to it at all. There's no sheen. I didn't wipe the windows off before I, I started started this. The windows are nasty. I'm not going to wash the whole car. Not until we know the rainy season is gone. Mm. So peaceful out here. It's just nice and quiet. Mm. Just does your heart. You hear little kids playing in the background. This is the house on the other side of the field there. You hear their dogs running around playing. Good stuff. Good, wholesome stuff. There we are. Three for three. 27 PSI. I think I had them set at the eight PSI that they asked for. But the tires just, I don't know. They seem a little low to me. Especially like our elements and stuff had the same size tires, I think. Pretty much. And they were all like 35 or 36 or something like that. I imagine, you know, the tires that were used back when this thing was made were probably just different. That's how you'd have to do it. Cool stuff, though. Don't you just love it when something just works? Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't phase the battery or anything like that. She's all, everything's all happy. That's pretty cool. The other one with the little M12 batteries, you do a lawnmower tire or whatever, and it's it knocks about half the battery out. But in all fairness, it takes a lot longer to uh, to fill it up. It's just bah, for a long time. And it, like I say, it times out after a little bit. I just love stuff that works. What you think? What you think? Yeah, there we go. Listen to roosters and stuff out there. Jet flying over. Of course, now the rooster's not gonna crow no more. <laughs> that was a quick one. <laughs> God dang. There's some colors for you. So peaceful out here. Swallows flying around. Just nature going about its business. All right, I'm go put my tools away here. Remember what I was telling you about Danny? What are you doing under there, buddy? Why do you like the back of the Acura, huh? He says, I just do. I'm a goofy dog. What can I say? <laughs> no rides in my personal stuff since we got back. I was thinking about it today. I probably would have if it just didn't get that late in the day. Plus, I'm all nasty from mowing the lawn and everything else. Danny, that sounds terrible. Well, hello there, YouTube. Once again, we're out here right at the cuffs of sunset. Mm -hmm. It's like eight minutes till uh, till sunset, or till nine, I think sunset's 8.56, 55, somewhere around there. So yeah, we're, we're right at it. 
But a productive day again today. Yes, it was. Yeah. Only, got a lot done. Yeah. Got that godforsaken lawn mode out there. I know. That's always nice. Look at Annie out there. They like it, too, because when they run around, their um, cables don't drag in the grass. Yes. Yeah, Not that it slows them down, but you'll notice they're way more frisky when the grass is cut like it's supposed to be. But it's amazing adding two, yeah, two days to, uh, well, because it was Saturday till Monday last week. Man, I don't know if we got a lot of rain when we were up there in Canada. Or what? Hey, That's Sasha, enough. Hey. <laughs> Uh, raining brass. Remember, he got one of the puppies. It's literally oh. Sasha's twin. His name's Harley. Oh. He was telling me that um, Harley does the same thing when they're, he's left with a sitter. He doesn't oh. eat and gets all weird and emotional and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Crazy old mother. Yeah, brother and, brother and sister, I reckon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, same mom and dad, everything. Yeah. That's just cool. Different time. Yeah, just, just little. He's about... Harley's about a year younger than Sasha. Yeah. Maybe a little bit more. But yeah, same same parents. Anyway, I think on that, we're going to bounce, build this log right quick, because I have to build it tonight, because it's yeah. back to the old grind tomorrow. Yeah, work is in the morning. Lord only knows what happens while you're gone I know. for a week. There will be issues. <laughs> a whole, um, <laughs> about issues. It could be, yeah. But there's a new bulletin of something. I don't remember what it was, but something with that and uh, whatever built up over the week. Yep. <laughs> All right. So I think we're going to bounce on it. All righty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Tuesday, Wednesday. All right. We'll see you. Actually, the crack of old dark tomorrow. Yeah. No, wait until late in the afternoon. Nope. We'll see you in the morning. We got to go to the J-O-B. Yeah. <laughs> All right. We'll see you then. Bye. Bye-bye now. Mm -hmm.